Hello and welcome back to King of Titan Racing. Today we're going to take a tour of my custom Aston Martin, but before we do that, let's take a quick look at all the fun we've had so far. Now to understand this car, there's only two things you need to know. One is that there's three types of Vantage, the V8, the V8S and the V12. And the second is that I took all my favourite bits and put them together. Now when I first turned the key as the owner of this car, I was ecstatic. I couldn't have been happier, it was a realisation of a 15 year goal. I had no plans to modify this, I, it was perfect in its own right. But, as you'll learn, I have very little self control. Now I did wrap the car immediately out of the showroom, but that was planned and it was to protect the paintwork. It wasn't until I started attending meets with other Vantages that I started looking at the detailing on those cars and started to wonder, what would my perfect Vantage look like? That's when I started sketching and designing and then finally pulled the trigger on this, the first piece. The V12 Vantage carbon fibre grille. Now from there, I moved on to the VAS facelift bumper and then matched that with it again, more carbon fibre on the lower splitter. But that as a whole, piece completely transforms the front end of this car. Moving along the side of the car, we've got the red calipers, which I had Aston do before collection, some more carbon fibre of course on the wing mirrors, and the V12 side sills. Now these make it look so much more aggressive and completely change the car's presence on the road. Now at the rear of the car, we find three more bits of carbon fibre, the two rear light inserts and this piece. This is the N420 special edition rear diffuser. It was the hardest piece to source and one of my favourite bits in the car. It completely changes the rear, and certainly for the better. Moving to the interior of the car, we find carbon fibre on the kick plates and on the door armrest. And right in the centre of the interior is that V12 metal shifter, which really changes the whole way you interact with the car. And now under the bonnet, we find that final piece of carbon fibre to finish it all off. The slam panel to perfectly frame that beautiful British V8. And I had to go ahead and get a custom plaque just to finish it off. Now all of this has been to complement an already highly specced car. Now all of these options could have been ordered from Aston Martin from new through the Q department, but I wasn't the first owner and I didn't get to spec this car. So when I went shopping, I knew I was going to be building a project, but I knew I wanted these wheels, those seats, and that stitching. And then from there, I just built my dream Aston. I have loved this journey. Designing cars is a huge passion of mine, as everybody knows, and doing it on a car like this, on this scale, it's just been a fantastic experience. Every time I added a piece of carbon fiber, it renewed that new car excitement. When I changed the shifter, one of the primary ways that you engage with the car, it just revamped the whole driving experience. Now I think this car's finished, but honestly, who knows? Now, let me know what you think in the comments. As always, a like and subscribe because it makes a huge difference to us as a channel. And thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.